So why introduce these guidelines? We want to set and raise the standards of diabetes care for all our older people. We want to make sure that A, they're screened for diabetes, so you know if they've got diabetes, um, but also that they get that annual review because the annual review can prevent other problems. So if you have an annual review and notice there's a foot problem, then it's not going to be too late to do something to prevent ulceration and amputation. Uh, we want a consistent approach to diabetes care and equity. It shouldn't matter where you're looked after, should it? Whether you're in a care home, your own home, or in hospital, it should be the same standards. We want to promote individualised targets for our older people, depending on what their need is, and to promote patient safety. And we certainly want to look at implementing standards for staff training, including competency assessment. So why? Well, you know what? What we do now is going to give us a legacy, isn't it? Yeah? I mean, nurses, we're supposed to work till we're, you know, really old now. Yeah? So we may actually just be going into our care home when we finish working on our Zimmer frame. Um, but we do want to make sure that what we put in place now benefits people now, but also there's a legacy effect because we're going to have much more people, much more older people. Thank you.